Hey everyone, this is MaverickArt075, aka the One Winged Angel, welcome back to Let's Play Crash Bandicoot Warped. In the last episode, we finished off World 4's Relic Races, and in this episode, we're going to start World 5's. Not much instruction that needs to be done. Um, World 4 was interesting. Got stumped a few times, that's for sure. Alright, first things first, we're clearing this guy. Even before the time trial starts, I feel like it'd be best if we cleared him out of the way. I'm curious, now I'm curious if there's some sort of loophole to deal with those guys, because as far as I'm aware, there isn't. Oh, pfft. Whoops! Wasn't supposed to do that. Alright, let's try that again. Now we're off to a great start. Oh, I can spin attack him? Oh, and now you gotta watch the abduction. Oh! He dropped me to my death! Rude. I didn't know you could spin attack him. I just thought you were supposed to just shoot him. All well, problem with that strategy is that it damages you, so we're not gonna do that. Alright, let's get running. Or try this again. Ah. I need to stop losing Aku Aku, because I feel like that's going to be really important for this run. See, considering how many Aku Akus they give me right off the bat, I feel like his invincibility is going to really come in handy. Probably time crates, but it's more of a hassle to get those destroyed than uh, it's worth, honestly. At least, if that is the case. Wait. Ah, I was right! Had a feeling this was going to come into play. Allows me to just charge through like crazy. Clear that entire section without even thinking about it. Woo! Alright, so now we gotta just run like crazy. Oh, another one! Even better! Woo! That was pretty fun. I'm actually curious what the uh, gold time was supposed to be. So, yep, that is all said and done. It only took three minutes, so we could get all of World 5 done in this episode. Unless things get a little difficult, which is entirely possible. And they're not going to show us what I was supposed to get. That's fine. Level 22. Motorcycle stage. And best time I have is 130. I'm going to guess that's not enough for the gold relic. So let's just try our best. Unfortunately, with the time trials, you don't have to come in first. You just need to, well, make it it it's a time trial. I mean, there's still, you know, opposition at the race against, but you don't have to come in first to get the relic. Fortunately, that would really suck if that was the case. If you had to do all get basically get there in time and come in first. Whoa, rude, rude. So let's try that again. That was exceedingly rude. Go away, good sir. Alright, so it's left jump so we can get this time crate. Go on here. 
without going off road. Go around you because no you. Wow. Car noises. Not sure that was 100% necessary, but that's okay. Nope. Not making any more car crashing mistakes. Done that more than enough times. Really probably should have used that uh, boost pad. Whoops. Uh, nope. Don't want that. And I've already forgotten what time I need to get for this race, but that's okay. Right, minute 36. Was for the sapphire. So gold, it's probably like minute 20 something. Don't you dare get in my way. Ah, crap. Off road, off road, off road, off road. That's bad. Alright, so there's no more opposition in my way. I just need to speed my way to the finish line. Time crates! Come on, please, 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 please. Please be good enough, please be good enough, please be good enough, please be good enough. Good enough! Woo! That went a lot better than I thought it would, to be quite honest. Ah, how my fingers are starting to hurt from playing so much Crash today. Especially with all the running and going as fast as I can. And now that level's done. Next level, high... No, not high time, no, Flaming Passion. Got minute 15 last time. Not sure if that got me a gold relic. So we're gonna aim for a minute 15. Pfft, already screwed that one up. So far, no time crates, so... Oh, come on! Get rid of those invincibility frames. Oh, well. Something I've noticed is that the uh, Arabian levels seem to rely more on uh, you using your... Uh, like, they don't give you as many time crates in the Arabian levels, so it's like, these ones you have to rely more on knowing the level and just finding shortcuts. Which, I don't, I don't mind. And not jumping off edges like that. That's fine. I can use a few invincibility frames. Wamp, wamp, wamp. Whoa, that was really close. Fine, we can work with this. Oh, no, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. And do I get a... Yeah! Did a lot better than the last time. I am not complaining whatsoever. And that was a lot easier than high times, that's for sure. That was a lot easier than high times. Oh crap. Next one is good old Mad Bombers. I gotta go back to Mad Bombers. Fortunately, this is the last time I'll ever... 
Right! I got a platinum on this last time! Okay, okay. Aim for 139. Right, I got platinum last time I did this level. Can I hit the target from here? Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to make this one. Where do you think you're going? This let's play have been getting better with the uh, plane stages, like a lot better. Can I make it? Can I make it? I'm not going to be able to make it. This one's still way too annoying to do. It wasn't even close. Ugh, how did I get such a good time last time? I don't even remember. Oh, that was bad. Uh, that got like a whole minute less last time. Almost. We're gonna find out. We're gonna try that again. There's another plane right there. Hey, get out of my face. Yeah, this run this run's already screwed up. Oh, I'm already dead. Great. Okay, the AI in these levels is just relentless. I hate it. This level will be a lot less annoying if these enemies didn't infinitely respawn. I know you're supposed to make this level challenging, but this is getting a little ridiculous. Come 
Come on. Come on. Yeah. How did I get that such a good time that first time? Yeah, I screwed up this run already. Did I at least get the uh, sapphire? Or did I miss it? missed it. I, I, I don't like this level. Again, this is easily my least favorite level in the game. Okay, you know, I'm screwing up. I'm screwed up this run already. I'm gonna try this again. Shoot its target from here. I guess that kind of makes it easier, is the fact you shoot your targets all the way from over here. Too bad I suck at aiming! It'd be a lot easier if Cortex's minions weren't shooting all the time. Like that. Go away. Okay, it's already proving to be a better run. Come on, get the heal crate. Get the heal. Get the heal. Get the heal. That's all the way over there. Lovely. Nope, nope. Don't focus on them. Just focus on the enemy plane. Hit it from here. Can I blow it up from here? Whoa, what happened? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, I got the sapphire. Probably not good enough for the gold. Probably not. Yeah, I didn't think so. We'll call it. All right, so we're gonna save our progress here, and then we're gonna find out what time I need to beat to get it. All right, what? How good do I need to be? Oh wow, get good scrub indeed. Ugh. I'll do that next episode. I'm, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try again next episode, and then also finish off world. Uh, world five. I really don't like that level, as you can tell. So we gotta beat a minute 55. That's, that's nasty. Lovely! Now, this is the one thing I was really worried about. So, I'm the Wondering Angel. This has been Let's Play Crash Bandicoot Warped. In the next episode, we're going to go back to Mad Bombers and once again try to beat it. So until then, I'll see you next time. Bye!